venerable Remington 870 has long been a staple of military and law enforcement since its introduction in 1951. Performing all matter of duties, from breaching, clearing rooms, and boarding ships, the 870 is a friend of first responders who value its knockdown power. Nothing will ruin a day quite like a round of buckshot or a slug to the chest. It's no surprise that the 870 appears in hardline. God gun? No. Gun of the gods. And like Thor's hammer, only the chosen may wield it. And to wield it properly, one must know how to use it correctly. This weapon isn't a simple matter of point and shoot. There are limits, both in range and functionality. An M16 can be used on any map, but not every map is suitable for the 870. If you find yourself on the block, though, you'll likely find the 870 right at home in your hands. Unmatched in close quarters combat, the 870 is a one-hit kill, but you have to hit your target, and you have to fire first. If you hesitate a moment to squeeze the trigger, you will more than likely meet your maker. If you take one hit and try to fire, your shot will be errant, and it will not completely hit its mark. In these instances, luck is your best ally. You may choose to fire from the hip, and you will have success, but if you want to unleash the full potential of the 870, like a baseball player, you must choke up, and by that, you must use a full choke. With a full choke, the buckshot on the 870 is highly concentrated. Accuracy is improved. You become a lethal close quarters fighting machine. But this power comes at a price. You lose your hip fire and you must exclusively aim down the sights. Fortunately, with the addition of the Micro T1, aiming is a snap. Literally, target acquisition is quick and the choke gives you range. Up to around 10 yards, the 870 will give you a one hit kill. Out to about 25, it could take up to three or four shots. For all but the luckiest, those four shots will likely result in your death. So choose your battles wisely. Not every one you pick can be won. The 870 takes time to reset and to fire, so accurate aim is a must. Tight confines, alleyways, and rooms are the 870's home. That is why the block is such a fit for the 870. If you must use the 870 on larger maps, it can still find good use. Covering the entryway as your team loads up on cash and blood money, or raiding the vault on bank job and heist. You can make the 870 work. But who should use the 870? Should the noob who thirsts victory and blood? The 870 is a tool for the initiated. Build up your skill, learn the maps, work your way up to it. The 870 is for those light on their feet, always moving, always prowling. Regardless of skill or talent, or even map, the 870 is a weapon you can have fun with if you know its limits and don't mind dying. But for those that are skilled, the 870 can make you legend. Up to Rises is the property of NFL Film and BMG Crystal Listen Juice with their express written consent. This video is not intended for marketing, profit, or monetization. It's for entertainment purposes only.